What's going on? It's Parker here with the Super 73 Shredded Edits. I got a special surprise for you guys here in this video. I'm going to be doing some riding on the new S2 as well as taking you to the Mint 400 with me while I go away racing and then showing you some behind the scenes of our GoPro shoot. Okay everyone, here we go. We're taking the S2 from Irvine all the way to Newport and some parks. I'm going to take you off-road and on-road on this so stay tuned. And as well, if you have any comments or questions while I ride along or you can think of stuff, just leave a comment below. One of the coolest new features on the all new S2 is its brand new frame. We went from the steel frame of the S1 to an aluminum alloy aircraft grade 6065 7071 frame. It is lighter, it's more rigid, and best of all, it's corrosion resistant for worry-free riding all year round. The S2 is powered by a brushless, internally geared DC hub motor that puts out about 2,000 watts of peak power. Pair that with the battery, which is 960 watt hours, the largest of any bike in its class, it is gonna give you a range of up to 40 miles on throttle only operation in class two mode. In the eco mode, with pedal assist, you're gonna get up to 75 miles range, which is incredible. Another feature that I wanna talk about on the S2 is that it comes standard with front suspension. The air fork is fully adjustable with rebound dampening, compression, and preload. I love this fork. I've had it on my Custom Z and my Custom OG for a long time. It's really nice. It improves the ride quality tenfold. I really think you're gonna enjoy it on the S2. The other thing I wanted to talk about is the headlight, which you obviously can't see from this bag-mounted GoPro that I have on. It's a 12 volt, it's got a halo around the outside, so it is very, very upper class. Um, it's the brightest light available on any Super 73, producing 630 lumens, so it is bright. If you do get stuck out after dark, if you just enjoy riding at night, this is the bike to do it. You do have a brake light uh, as well for that. The other cool thing about the frame, which I didn't mention earlier, is its internal cable routing. So it's reduced the clutter quite a bit on the actual frame itself, so we don't have to have all the zip ties and everything hanging off. It's just a really clean extra thing that Super 73 is doing. It does cost more to do, but it is totally worth it when you see the finished product. The quality is through the roof. The other fun part on this bike, the Badger tires there are proprietary tread, I've talked about them several times, being five inch in the rear. It's roughly 60% road-based and 40% off-road based. So if you're doing light trail riding, this is the perfect tire for that. It looks tough, it rides nice, it's got big treads on it as well, so if you're off-road, you're gonna get traction. And uh, it's got a nice profile, so if you're on the road, it's gonna tip in and turn and brake and do all the stuff you expect it to do very, very well. The seat height of the S2 sits at about 31 inches, which is designed to take riders ranging from 5'1 all the way up to 6'8. Just for some comparison in this video, I'm roughly 6'2 and I fit on the seat pretty easily right in the middle. The other cool thing about the bike is it comes standard with a two-person seat, so if you slide forward, you can fit a passenger on the back, but just keep in mind the weight rating on the bike is roughly 325 pounds. Another feature that I have to mention but I can't show you just yet is the Super 73 app. The app is going to be a suite that's going to connect you with other Super 73 owners so you can plan group rides. It's going to give you the ability to put in turn-by-turn -turn navigation that you can show on your display. And it's also going to send diagnostics back to us here at Super 73 so we can check your bikes out and send updates as needed. Things you see at Super 73. Um, and then... <laughs> Did it. A little bit behind the scenes of our GoPro slash St. Patrick's Day content. I got the 24 karat gold S1. I got Mac. I got Carson. Taylor's filming it. Um, I keep eating. Keep eating hair. Leprechauns too. Oh. <laughs> Stunts. Oh. 
action. <laughs> We're at the Super Hooligans event here uh, within the Mint 400 at the Buffalo Bills Casino in Prim, Nevada. So there's so Super 73s everywhere here. <laughs> Two to five seconds. Put him in. Vlogging and riding, obviously. <laughs> so that's Preston. He's one of the videographers. He's got a Z1. He goes around, and shoots on it. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, you know that guy Parker? He's a really good dude. <laughs> Said no one ever. <laughs> oh, Justin out here shooting. I ain't seen the wave limit on this thing, but it's fine. I looked online. You it, don't. The wave limit's 275, and I am far past 275. Is it handling it? Oh yeah. So. Such a sick Z. guys that wraps up this week's shredded edit thank you very much for watching if you've got any questions comments please leave them below i do watch i am listening um stay tuned so subscribe push that little bell button so you get notified i'm uploading videos every week behind the scenes here at super 73 i hope that you guys want to see more of that so thank you so much take care we'll see you next ride